The Live Editor provides a new way to create, edit, and run MATLAB code. You can see your results together with the code that produced them. Add equations, images, hyperlinks, and formatted text to create an interactive narrative you can share with others. You can open an existing script in the Live Editor by selecting Open as Live Script. Existing published markup is converted to formatted text. When you run the Live Script, output and plots are displayed together with the code that produced them. Let's illustrate some of the features of the Live Editor by creating a Live Script to estimate sunrise and sunset times throughout the year. When a new Live Script is opened, a gray bar appears. This is where you type your MATLAB code. Let's start with some code to calculate the solar time correction and plot it over the course of the year. When you run the code, the output and plot appear together with the code inside the Live Editor. If you click on an output value, the cursor shows you which line of code produced that output. You can display your output inline, or you can display your output on the right. You can divide your code into sections. This section will be used to calculate the solar declination for the days of the year. Sections can be used to divide a program into logical parts. You can run each section individually. Errors appear next to the line where they occur. You can fix the error and rerun the section. We'll create one last section that uses the solar time correction and the solar declination to estimate the time of sunrise and sunset for each day. When we run the code, we see our final result, a plot of sunrise and sunset over the course of the year. So far, we have used the Live Editor to do some exploratory programming to complete our analysis. The Live Editor also allows you to include additional information to help others understand your work. Let's add some text to describe the solar time correction calculation. You can create a title and headings for each section. You can use bold, monospace, or italics for emphasis and create bulleted or numbered lists. You can add supporting material to your narrative such as hyperlinks or images. Let's include a diagram illustrating the concept of solar declination. You can also add equations to provide the mathematical basis for your work. Equations are entered as LaTeX commands. The equation editor shows you a preview of your equation as you type. The Live Editor also supports multilingual text, so you can work in any language. Let's save our Live Script. Live Scripts are saved using a new file format with the MLX extension. This new file type stores input, output, and formatted text. Now let's look at a final version of our script. We've created an interactive narrative with MATLAB code and results together with text, equations, images, and hyperlinks that tell a story about the analysis. Now you can share your live script with colleagues or students so they can understand what you've done, replicate your results, and extend your analysis. If you want to publish your analysis, you can save it as PDF or HTML. If you need to share your work with someone on an earlier version of MATLAB, you can save the file as a traditional MATLAB script. The Live Editor can be used for presentation or instruction. You can create a live script for a lecture and save it without the output. In the classroom, you can then step through each section explaining concepts and executing code as you go. You can give the lecture to students so they can follow along during class or review the material later. You can also use your live script as the basis for assignments. In this video we have seen how the live editor can be used for exploratory programming, creating an interactive narrative, and as a tool for instruction and presentation. Try the live editor today. Start with an existing script or open one of the live editor examples in the MATLAB documentation.